<clears throat> no, 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 it's, it's fine, it's fine. Just give me, give me a second to kind of regroup myself together here. Yeah, okay, okay. I can, I can do it, I can do it. I can, no, I, I got this, I got this. Hey everybody. Normally, um, normally I come up here and my stomach is doing jackknifes because I am very uh, afraid. It's, it's a, not a big secret that I have a lot of stage fright actually for all the performing I do. Tonight it's doing some backflips back both because um, uh, you know, I'm, I'm nervous and because I just saw Johnny and Tater sharing one gigantic pair of underpants. <laughs> but these things happen, these things happen. Um, it, it is true though, I, I started out uh, doing stage work because I wanted to conquer this thing that is, is deep inside of me that just makes me freak out when I get on a stage. I, I started out uh, at the very beginning, I remember I had a theater teacher who said to me, and I, I will never forget these words, if you are nervous, that's good because otherwise you died backstage. Okay, so I've been carrying that with me for a long time, which you can imagine backstage is not any calmer because I'm backstage going like this hoping it works out. Then I'm out here and I'm freaking out. The, the second experience I, I remember of that is the first performance I had with the Circus Freaks. I, I, I walked up backstage to a show we were doing and I was shaking. I mean, I was absolutely shaking. And this guy named Big Bill Edelson, he said to me, he said, no one walked in this place and, and, and got their ticket and sat down and said, gosh, I hope this sucks. No one's doing that. No one's, no one's hoping that you're going to fail. Everyone here wants me to get through this and we have a good night, right? The delay on there has helped the, the butterflies. We'll try again. No one wants me to fail. Right, you want me to succeed and be amazing and, and, and host the show. It doesn't, yeah, and it doesn't matter what I'm doing. I mean, tonight you're going to see performers up here who are going to do all sorts of things. Uh, I don't like to throw a lot of adjectives around, uh, but you're going to see a lot of you're going to see a lot of performers, and they're all going to be suffering the same stuff going on in their guts. The best advice I ever got is you're going to have butterflies. Just get them all flying in one direction and hope for the best. That's thank you. I had an opportunity uh, to to have this have this validated for me. I uh, I and a, a couple of the Circus Freaks performers next week will actually be attending clown school again. Me, I'm going back. Some of our performers are going for the first time. Um, and uh, we, got, we all got a letter, an email, and it said, if you're scared of this process, good, because if you're not absolutely terrified on some level, you're, you're do you shouldn't be doing this. You should be absolutely afraid. When you get up here, you should be afraid, and then conquer that and feel awesome. That's kind of what we do here. And it's, it's edgy, it's scary. I mean, shout if you've never been on a stage before. You can't, because <laughs> you were here early. But everybody here knows this. I was gonna come up on the stage and say, you know, shout if you've never done this and talk to those people, but I realized in this room, the only place on earth where I can say, do you guys get this? And every one of you says, yeah! it's scary and you grind through it. The nicest thing I can tell you about working on new material in this environment is weird noises happen over there. <laughs> But the second thing I can tell you is that you're not alone. It doesn't matter at what level you're working, someone else has experienced it. And so this is a really good place because most of them are here. Thank you and welcome.